it's obviously a very scary case. Kenton so County Commonwealth's attorney Rob Sanders, Sanders says this is where Paul Snow's alleged crimes took place, his home in Verona. One victim um, was apparently hired to do some housekeeping work for Mr. Snow. A couple different victims had entrusted Mr. Snow with repairing electronic devices that they gave him uh, to look at. An arrest affidavit lays out the accusations for the crimes in Kenton County spanning between 2014 and 2017. The details are too graphic to share. On social media, dozens of women have shared their own creepy encounters with snow. Whitney Beach is one of them. It's sickening. I don't know how else to describe it. It's, it makes me sad for the victims that it took this long. Beach can't help but think what might have happened. a uncomfortable feeling. Beach says she and her boyfriend had gone to his home to Firewood, but then he asked her to come back. I didn't want anybody to come with me, and I was just like, no, um, not doing that, not coming to your house by myself. So then after that, I had blocked him, and he would continue making multiple accounts and following me on other social media platforms. Brianna Henderson says she had to block him too after meeting him on Snapchat. He started asking me if I wanted to hang out, spend time together, and I'm like, no, I, I don't know you. He was just really weird and very pushy. So when I had seen all these charges or these women talk about it, I was like, I'm not, I'm not surprised. While what they experienced was not criminal, they hope justice is served for the women who have come forward. Yeah, and one woman tells me she credits the lead detective on the case in Kenton County for taking her seriously and, quote, doing something about this monster. Gallatin County's Commonwealth's attorney, Lewis Kelly, tells me while much credit is owed to the Kenton County Police Department, he also praises Gallatin County Sheriff Bud Webster, whose hard work set all of this in motion. You can always find our stories here on YouTube, but go ahead and tap subscribe. That way you're always in the know.